unity stands united in their support for Ukraine and its That is why we gather here today to discuss how to ensure and how to sustain the financing of the recovery, reconstruction and modernization of Ukraine for years and decades to come. Because Ukrainian cities and power stations are protected. So that's what, it is, what is at stake here, nothing less than creating a new Marshall Plan for the 21st century, a generational task that must begin now. The recovery, reconstruction and modernization of Ukraine will indeed be a challenge for generations, one that will require the combined strength of the entire international community. But it is also an opportunity for generations to come if we get it right. Salaries for military and security forces. Salaries for We have no time to waste. The scale of destruction is staggering. The World Bank puts the costs of the damage at 350 billion euros. This is for sure more than one country or one union can provide alone. We need all hands on deck. ...to pay the bare minimum every single day. Salary and I'm working with our member states that the union could support Ukraine with up to 1.5 billion euros every month of the war, which would be in sum round about 18 billion euros in 2023. The United States and of course from the international financial institutions. Ukraine needs fast rehabilitation right now as we speak, especially as Russia is deliberately leading targeted attacks on civilian infrastructure with a very clear aim to cut off men, women and children of water, electricity and heating as the winter is approaching. These are pure acts of terror.